Greetings, unsettled souls. Welcome to the correct views. It has it's the missing one. Uh, Sam I B D Ganji, uh, founder of the feast, as my friend John says. Um, that, uh, the live the live stream on the media speaks is up. That hasn't been the case for a very long time. Um, there's been a, a computer problems, and I needed to take the computer into the shop. That's why it's almost the end of the month. I'm posting this on the 29th. It may be pushed a day or two by the time the other segments are done. And I didn't get time to do the Don't Scout for the Month show due to the computer. The, I didn't think the computer was going to be in the shop for as long as it was. But again, Andre does amazing work, as you can see. So what I'm going to be doing with the Dunce Cap of the Month Award show is combining November and December and still letting you guys pick the dumbest story of the year. Uh, they're both going to be pushed into one show. I had to do that once before. I think for the same reason. I don't remember. But the Dunce Cap for November and December will be done in December due to the computer problem, which means I can now get on to the massive... Fukushima update. You know, I'm going to put the light over here closer to the, the screen, darken my ugly face a little bit. You know, it's a strange day when China has a legitimate point. Now, hear me out. China, the butcherous communist regime of China. Have you ever heard that this show doesn't tend to have a lot of really positive things to say about the leadership of China? Well, today's a rare day, and he's right. Z's right. Global Times. The China's foreign minister asks Japan why it won't release Fukushima water into its own lakes if it's really harmless. Think about this. Really think about this. We've been hearing forever, remember? You all know. We've been hearing forever that it's not going to hurt anything to release radiologically toxic water into the Pacific Ocean. It'll be diluted. Well, dilution is not the solution for pollution. We've already covered why. But China's saying something intelligent here. Why are you dumping it into the ocean? It's not salt water. It's fresh water. You could dump it anywhere. If it's so safe, if it's not going to hurt anything... Then by all means, Japan, please, if you would be so kind, please go ahead and dump it into your own water supply. Why are you dumping it into the ocean for? I'm sorry. Can any, anybody at all tell me why China's wrong here? Anybody? No. Crickets. That's why. They have literally proved... They've, they, they've, they've proved beyond any shadow of a doubt that Japan... That looks better. Japan does not, and if even for a moment, think it's safe. Listen to this. After the Nuclear Safety and Security Commission of South Korea expressed regrets over Japan's radiological impact assessment on the release of Fukushima wastewater into the ocean, claiming it was safe when, when proven on this show that it is not, the Chinese foreign minister asked Japan why it would not release the nuclear-contaminated wastewater into its own lakes if it believes that the water is harmless. Is the discharge of contaminated water from the Fukushima nuclear plant really inevitable, or is Japan just going its own way for its own selfish interests? If the nuclear-contaminated water is harmless, why wouldn't Japan release it into its own lakes? Japan, please answer the question. Zhao Lijon, spokesman for the Chinese Foreign Ministry, I just made him sound French because I butcher the Chinese language. Uh, he said this on Friday. Zhao's remarks came after, oui, oui, after the operator of the Fukushima nuclear power plant said Wednesday that treated radioactive water would have an extremely small impact on the environment, marine life, and humans when it was released into the sea, according to the... AP. Well, since the Japan government unilaterally decided to release contaminated wastewater into the sea in April, 
Public questions and opposition from Asia-Pacific countries and within Japan has not stopped, but Japan has not given a convincing explanation <coughs> on the decision's rationality, necessity, and safety. Again, Zhao's right. Why? Why would they have to dump it into the ocean? He said seven months after making the decision, Japan came up with an assessment report which further showed that the decision made back in April was not scientific or rigorous, Zhao said. He also said, going on here, that Japan has turned a deaf ear to the legitimate, and they are, concerns and appeals of the international community over the past seven months. And what the international community has seen is that the Japanese community in charge of the disposal of contaminated water in Fukushima has repeatedly tampered with data and concealed the truth. Yeah, they've outright lied. Absolutely. And we've shown it. We've shown how on this show. Zhao reiterated that the disposal of contaminated wastewater in Fukushima is by no means a private matter for Japan. Thank you. We must exercise extreme caution and carry out strict supervision. Japan should earnestly respond to the voices of neighboring countries and its own people. Excuse me. Reverse its wrong direction and fulfill its due international obligations. Japan should not let its black swan of nuclear leaks turn into an overwhelming gray rhino of nuclear contamination. Guess what? He's right. For those of you that are going to say it's safe, all right, I got a few questions for you. If it's safe, then why is it that we can't pull one salmon out of the Pacific Ocean which doesn't have Fukushima radiation in it, sometimes at levels which are bordering on legal and would not have been legal before the levels were changed in order to save the Japanese fishing industry. Why is that? Also, if it's not safe that the contamination is in... I mean, if it's not dangerous that the radioactivity is in the salmon because people don't eat that much salmon. Okay, that's great. How much salmon is safe then? It would seem to me there'd be some point we'd be like, all right, this, that much radioactivity is not safe. They don't do cumulative studies. Why is that? That's just a couple of questions. The best question is, however, still, and let me repeat, if the wastewater is so safe, Japan, why are you releasing it into the ocean instead of releasing it into your own lake? in streams good question isn't it all right friends thank you for listening hit share hit subscribe it's the massive fukushima update